this one is from uh, somebody called Anita. She says, now please ask Joe Metal about his brand sustainability. Some of us are not seeing top. He's been able to sustain his brand over the years. Nothing wrong. What is he doing differently from the rest of us? <laughs> what are you doing differently? You see, uh, I, I believe that individually God gives each one of us graces. Sometimes I think that we are we're quick to compare rather than learning. You can learn from people. You don't necessarily have to chase. I've, I've seen in our time competition. I've seen in our time um, trying to be like others. So You've when, never felt the need to compete? Oh, no, 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 no. Never. No, no. So this is what it is. When people are ahead of me, yeah. I'm encouraged to learn from them rather than competing with them. Because okay. I can never be them. I've, yeah. I, I learned that at a very early stage of my life that you can never be like someone. You can never be. So I realized that if I... So this is the thing. There's a whole assignment laid down for me. And all I've been doing is trying to be like someone. I've been trying to chase the person's tail. And I've left my assignment down. Mm -hmm. You know, and I've done that at the early stages of my life before I realized it didn't work. Okay. Well, I've done that before, but when, I mean... When you were with Soul Winners? Even when I was with Soul Winners, I was, I was just following orders. So that was even different. Yeah. You know, but when I, I came into full-time ministry, I realized that, no, I'm supposed to learn from people who have gone ahead of me, not to compete with them. Okay. You know, so if I don't know, I don't know, I'll ask you, boss, how do you do this? Then I learn from it. You know, I got the chance of learning from different people. Because so I realized... Some of the artists you've been able to learn from? Oh, I, 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 I learned... I, I served with people like Cindy Thompson. So I worked with her for a couple of years. So I learned from her. Love her. I learned from the late Danny Nete. I got the chance of working with the likes of Soul Winners. I've learned from the Daughters, the Tego Sisters, for everyone. Are there secular artists that you have learned from? Um, I, I guess, secular artists, let me see. Maybe years ago. I tell you, some, some years ago, I, I, I used to listen to uh, Boys to Men. Boys to Men. I used to like their, <laughs> no, it was, I think it was more like arrangements, vocal uh, stuff that they used to do okay. back in the day, yeah. I thought you were going to say Ghana rap software, you know, book back. But, because I don't rap. I don't, rap. I don't know how to rap. Hello, Paddy, I'm talking to yeah, you. Listen, listen to, to me. <laughs> okay, let's, let's listen to one more song from the album, from okay. the Experience album. 